Girl, y'all done messed up now. Y'all done let the wrong person get a vlog camera. Now y'all let the right person get a vlog camera. who have never seen my face before hi my name is Des um I had some videos on my channel I archived them all because I just wanted to start over fresh and I'm so excited because y'all have been asking me like girl when we get another vlog da 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 and I was like look <laughs> it's coming I made the impulse decision today to go buy a camera so I found the this I'm shooting on the Sony ZV F1 I got it from Best Buy and then I got a couple of little um, accessories from Best Buy today I'm gonna order some other stuff tomorrow I do TikTok I do Instagram reels on my business page like in between creating content for Instagram trying to film YouTube videos and all this other stuff on one phone on this little iPhone 12 Pro Max it was a lot and I only have 128 gigabytes on this phone I'm not, I sat in this car and I set this camera up I did <laughs> y'all she printed this receipt at 114 I've been sitting in the car for 40 some minutes getting this camera together but I have um, a couple things to do today I'm probably we're gonna go to the shop for I probably charge the camera on my way to the shop and then we'll chat once i get there i just took off the band and i just wanted to see i want y'all to see what the lace is looking like i'm just gonna spray a little bit of melt spray on there and then blow dry it just because um i'm trying out a new glue to see if i want to sell it so far i'm probably not it's not terrible like my my wig is still down pretty good it's just my edges would lift slightly and i didn't like that this is also my first time having like a full frontal Install with no baby hairs, and I'm kind of living it. In a perfect world where the camera was fully charged, I would show y'all the full process of me curling my hair. But I ain't gonna lie, I feel like it's kind of boring, you know? I feel like it's a little bit bore. Let's curl my hair, look at that. Hair from my hair company. I don't sell hair, but I do provide it. So if you want a service done by me and you want the same quality of hair as I'm currently wearing, hit me up via email or you can text me. It doesn't really matter. Okay, so update. I finished curling my hair. I'm not gonna comb it out yet. I'm gonna wait. Uh, this side look a little different. I don't even care. I didn't even really cut any layers into this, this hair, but I put the band back on because it wasn't melted enough for my liking. But we finna head home. I need to go to the crib because I want to line my lips before I go. <laughs> Could I just go straight there and take this picture? Yes. But I want to line my lips and put on a little bit of under eye concealer. Now it is time to head out. Let's go get in the car. And let's head back home. So I decided um, I wanted to wait to take my picture just because I don't feel like going to CVS no more. So now I'm at home about to do some household stuff. I am about to go take my trash out. Um do a little bit of laundry unfortunately and then just straighten up around the house what's y'all's least favorite chore for me it's laundry i would rather sit up here and and wash the dishes before i do laundry that's how much i hate folding it because i personally feel like laundry is a never-ending chore like it literally just does not stop look at my christmas tree isn't it so cute can y'all see yeah look at my christmas tree i love it and then i have everybody's gifts down there I am almost done Christmas shopping. I've been adding like little bits and pieces for everybody. Like everybody has everything they want, but I'm giving them a little bit extra because it's the season of giving and I love that. And if you're watching this video located in Birmingham or in surrounding areas, you should book an appointment with me from December the 18th through December 23rd. I did extend my hours from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. So you can get an appointment anytime between those times. No emergency fees, no extra fees, none of that. And you'll be entered in a um, you'll be entered in a giveaway. So you could either win a free install for first place, fifty percent off for second place, or twenty five percent off for third place. And it'll be two winners for each category. So that's a total of six discounts that you'll be eligible for if you end up booking an appointment for that week. So yeah, I've never ever 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 in my four years of doing hair, I've never given away anything for free. So I really think that y'all should take this chance, this opportunity to jump on that. So yeah. I'll check in with y'all in a moment. My closet is looking a mess, y'all. Look, I have my stuff organized slightly by color. I tried to follow the Roy G. Beav and put all the black on one side. Don't look at my purses, they're a mess. But yeah, I 
from that part, it looks great. Down here, let's not talk about it. <laughs> adapter um so that i can edit on my macbook so let's take that out and then that's trash this is the little phone mount i don't i don't think i'm gonna use this i'm not gonna use my phone to vlog in public for real, for real unless i'm shooting with my back camera so i don't really need this but i'll keep it for now and then this is trash as well. so let's throw that away and throw this away Ever since my roommate from college said that her room was like a reflection of her mental state, I've been trying to keep like my space somewhat neat. Like obviously it ain't gonna be the neatest all the time, but for the most part, let's keep it a little bit neat. That way I won't feel like I'm going insane. I'm also finna watch baddies. I should've took out something to cook. Um, if y'all don't watch baddies, honestly, I wouldn't recommend it. It's not that good. But I would like to see how it ends. So I do tune in on Sundays. This season will probably be my last season that I watch though, just because I can't take it. I can't take too much. They have no storyline and they pick somebody to bully. I don't like that. Natalie Nunn should not be in the house with them. She needs to actually be the executive producer and sit out on the outside. She needs to be behind the camera. I haven't even started the episode yet and I'm already irritated. They're saying it's eviction day. Roly has decided that it's time for people to go. It's time for Roly to go. After watching this last episode, they are so annoying. <laughs> but anyway, let's transition into a cooking portion of today's video. I'll never record me or film me cooking because I don't got time. Listen, other folks like to tell you what to do and all this. Look. I never claimed to be a chef. I never said I went to culinary school, nothing. I make things the way that I like to eat them. And that's just how I go for real, for real. So I'm gonna pop the camera up, record a couple clips for y'all to see. And then I'm gonna eat, and then I'm gonna head over to my man house. The angles is angling, honey. Let me wash my hands real quick. Y'all know what this makes me think of? Chicken. I like to use um, I like to use mustard and of course I know y'all probably think that like ugh I don't like mustard you're not supposed to taste the mustard it just works as a little binder that's all so I just take it I'll just use my bare hands and just wash them I need to put some more paper towels out here because I am definitely one of them people who go through all my paper towels and I told y'all I was gonna make like some flavor rice but now that I'm looking at it girl this is um I think this is some type of pasta side it says chicken flavored broccoli. So yeah, this is fettuccine noodles. Girl, I thought it was rice, but whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and season her up. I told y'all my holy trinity. Season salt, onion powder, and garlic powder. I feel like honestly, depending on what you're making, that's all you really need. Not too much, not too little. Oh, this is the one that ain't open. I'm gonna add some chili powder in there too, just for a little spice. Then the plate with the game, play with the game. She's fading away, fading away. Air fryer. Place them skin side down. Like so, like that. Spread them out so they'll have enough space. I would usually cut off the end. I just ain't feel like y'all. I ain't gonna say I'm being lazy, but this is a quick eat because I'm supposed to be at my man's house. Like, and I just didn't supposed to be over there. Like, but I'm just for the girl. <laughs> I have to get my house in order at least a little bit. And of course, clean as you go. So there's less things you have to worry about when you come back home. Wash, I also said wash your grease. Lord, that ain't got to me. Or God, whatever that means. I was gonna say wash your rice, not your grease. And 
how low key probably put too much in here. Um, a lot of folks don't know how to cook rice. You gotta put it, put that rice in there, leave it alone. Let it cook. So hopefully by the time my rice is done cooking, er, hopefully by the time my chicken is done cooking, my rice will be done as well. I'm about to go ahead and prep some green beans because I bought a bunch of green beans. So yeah. I do use canned green beans. Again, this is, this is something quick and easy, baby. This is not no wrong with our house to it. I am 22 years old. I will be damned if I make everything from scratch every day. That's not, mm -mm. So sorry to disappoint the girls. And then I ain't finna put nothing on here but salt and pepper. Keep it plain and simple. I'm tempted to make a little sauce, like a little garnish to put over my chicken, but I don't feel like it. And low key, I'm not even hungry no more. Essentially, how I make my, whenever I cook canned vegetables, literally all I do is put them in a pot and heat them up. And then you can use whatever seasonings you want. I told y'all I'm only using salt and pepper. For salt, I like to pour a little bit in my hand and garnish it over there like that. Like so, like that. We're not using a whole bunch of salt. Because we don't want high cholesterol and hypertension. And then for pepper, I just eyeball it. Season this together for the grape beans. Just put that on low. That can just take its time. Pour this rice, let that sit, cook that on five. And then, yeah, so everything is cooking. We got our starch, we got our protein, we got our vegetable. I am about to, well, let's put these seasonings up. This is not a cooking tutorial, by the way. You do what works for you, okay? I'm not telling y'all how to cook, so don't come telling you. Oh, that sounds kind of rude. I'm sorry. Sorry, yeah, I think I'm gonna play around with this adapter to see if my videos actually transfer onto the Mac Beezy, cause that'll be really nice. Plus, it's already out. My um rice is already done. I got like seven minutes left on my chicken. Just about to go in with a little spoonful of butter, maybe a bit on low, so the little bit of water that was in here could cook down, and it's pretty much perfect. So we're gonna go in with that same. Oops, we're gonna go in with that same method for salt and that should be enough. So let's mix, 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 mix. Life hack, I like to put my forks and spoons in the in the little holes on the handles and they can fit. The chicken has one minute of cook time left, so let's just go ahead. Well oh, it's like less than a minute of cook time. So let's go ahead and prep the plate. Get out of y'all's teeth when y'all be flossing. What y'all be doing? <laughs> I need to grab some more. Um, or you can see if I have some pads up here. I do, praise God. I'm gonna grab some, um, grab some pads to take with me over there because I did not feel like going to the store. Put these in the part of my boot bag. Turn my hair off. Let's close this so it's not freezing when I get back. Let's go ahead and unplug the tree. Grab my little book bag. Phones in here. Got my keys. I'm gonna leave at the house now and edit at his house. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I hope y'all enjoy. I love y'all so, so, so much. And cheers to a new journey, new vlogs, new adventures, and everything under the sun. I love y'all. Good night. Mm -hmm.